Let's look at Oliver next. So, Oliver has been upgraded, as you can plainly see. This was made out of my old Thomas Wooden Railway Ashima. So, he has the Thomas Wood Ryan face. I've got a couple of spare Ryan faces. And I decided to give Oliver this Ryan face. Because I'm actually basing mm, this sad. off of um, Mega Hedgehog X's Trackmaster 2 version of Oliver. So, I have subscribed to Mega Hedgehog X. And I think it was really nice that he commented about one of my videos. It may be that video where I showed you Thomas Wood Roger, and as well as that Trackmaster Push Along Roger. He must really like my Roger customs, and he was thinking of doing a Wood and Trackmaster Push Along Roger. But anyways, let me know what you guys think about this new version of Oliver. Do you like it? I hope you do. I think it looks pretty good. And here is Ryan's new model. So Ryan here is made from the Thomas Wood Ashima. This was actually um, Lily's old model, but I do have a new model of her. I'll show it, her to you in a future custom video. I did purchase two new trains, but I won't show those until next time. So the reason why Ryan's got a new body is that he was worried that his smaller body would get as damaged as this one. So this bigger body should help him get less damaged. And this is actually based off of popular Paxton's version of Whiff. I mean Ryan. I almost said Whiff there. Because he does look like Whiff now. And here is what someone suggested I do. This is Alfred from Train Tales. That person who suggested Alfred suggested I should write his name and give him the number one. We do already have Alfred here, who is the B12. But this is Mr. Bluebell Engine's OC of Alfred. I mean, some trains can have more than one of the same name. Like Alfred here. As well as a couple others. Maybe you guys can name them. And someone... That person who suggested Alfred, I think that guy may have suggested I do Boris and Bobby. But if there are any characters from Train Tales or British Railway Tales you would like me to make, please tell me in the comments below. I would like to make them. Now here is a villain who has reformed. This is Silver, the Splendid Silver Engine. Let me explain about Silver. So this is not Silver James from An Engine of Many Colors, although I think of it as Silver James, but this is Silver, Popular Paxton's original character. So Silver was mainly on the bad side due to the fact that he always got angry about someone scratching his paint. And when they heard of the superstition, the villains took it over. Silver was Boulder's second in command that basically means right-hand man, second-in-command. So, he, Boulder was, I assume, the leader. And originally, Silver was plain Silver, but when Tiffany told Silver that Scaredy was colorblind, he decided to get some stripes added to him. He was going to get gold stripes, but they were yellow. When Vinny saved Silver from the mine a long time ago, Silver decided to reform. And now he is on the good side, along with Tipper, Topple, and Tumble, the double in the dumper cars. <sighs> I get I get yeah, tongue twisted there. Alright, here's the last one of part two. This is Randall, the um same class as Silver and James. So Randall here was one of the villains of the superstation. He um, was known to have put a curse on William the Diesel. But he was stopped a long time ago. And recently he's returned on Sodor. And now he owns the Superstation along with a few other villains. And same thing with Silver. He was plain white until he heard that Scary was colorblind. So Silver and Randall got some new stripes added to them. I think that's a pretty nice change. I mean, I liked them better when they were plain, but that's just me. Maybe you guys would like them with their stripes added to them. 
I do really love that Silver is now on the good side, but I don't know who should be Boulder's new second-in-command. If I had to say, I think Randall should be Boulder's new second-in-command, since he does look like Silver. But maybe you guys have an opinion. Who do you think should be Boulder's new second-in-command? And thanks for watching part two. Stay tuned for part three, because we have these six last... See you there.